remember the day when you left for Santa Monica. You left me here to play some more LA Rush. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's the screaming fans right there. The screaming fans, screaming for, for an encore there. Okay, hello and good evening, YouTube. Welcome back to some more LA Rush. La Rouche, the French baking game. I don't know, dude. I'm tired. We're playing some more of this. Um, last time, um, lots of things happened. Um, I talked about a homeless guy. That was a, that was a good part. I, I enjoyed that part. I'm going towards the Retribution. I'm going to do it in the Dodge Ram, I guess. That's just the car that it spawned me with. I'm pretty sure I ended the game stealing the GTO. Actually, hang on a second. There's a... There's a stunt token. <laughs> hey. Stunt token. Woo! Yeah. Go! Oh, no. Okay. Well, looks like we're doing this. Okay. Yeah, so this is uh it doesn't tell you the next one before you go to it see now i have to turn my ass around and go just it's just this one is just we're just going in any direction that the game feels like going in at this point and it's not accelerating go faster pickup slow ass okay anyway what on earth dude okay looks like we're going that way and now we're going this way this way, this way, this way, this way, this way. Are you kidding me, dude? What's destructible in this stupid place? It aims me directly at a fence and then doesn't even make that fence breakable. What am I even supposed to do in that situation, dude? All right, well, that was awful. Well, we're just gonna ignore that. I'm, I'm gonna go back on the original path. We're gonna do this retribution. <laughs> Let go. Woo! It's time for you to seek revenge. Let's do it. Yay. Santa Monica Retribution, man. That sounds like a... That sounds like a pop-punk band from 2002. Santa Monica Retribution. Trix, it's Ryan again. Lydell's expanding his business interest. That clown just bought a Ferris wheel over the pier. And it's getting repainted. Buying right a now. Ferris wheel. Pedal, what a clown. Down, and then make like cotton candy and disappear. What? <laughs> That's an analogy. All right. Well, I got a mint to drive over here, I guess. Okay, cool. Let's go. Woo. Oh, the game lagged. The game lagged right when the fridge turned on. What was that? Oh, no, dude. Oh, no. Oh, no. Big left turn, woo! Here we go. Yep. That's the Ferris wheel. Run into that bitch, yeah. <laughs> oh, destructible environments. Look at that. Look at it come down. Yay. Wow, those guys on the roller coaster are seeing the show of their lives. All right, well, that was fun. We destroyed the Ferris wheel. That is uh, billions in collateral and potentially several people dead. Ooh, a roadblock. This is not like Midnight Club or uh, not Midnight Club, uh, Need for Speed Most Wanted. You know, we've been, we, I've made a lot of comparisons to Need for Speed Most Wanted in this playthrough so far, but this, this is not one of them. You do not want to run in to the police. Well, actually, if I ran into the police officer, it probably would have blown up and, like, that would have cleared the pathway, so... You know, maybe I was wrong. Maybe I should have actually ran into them there. Anyway, I'm turning right. Oh, no, that was a poor choice. Oh, I'm... I'm, I'm, I'm dead. It's over. Vehicle stopped. Wow. That was a very effective job by the police there to box me in in the pillar. You know, most of the time they just straight up just back up and get out of the way, but no. No, they actually got me there. Oh. I didn't know that there were actually replays. I thought that I thought the replay meant like try again. No, there's like actual replays. Look at this. Well, here's where the thumbnail. 
<laughs> Here's where the thumbnail's gonna come from. Woo! Oh, the shaking camera, dude. Oh, the, the angles are awful. Tricks is Ryan. Come on, dude. Oh, I pressed triangle and it got me out of that. All right, sure. Yeah, it gives you an insane time limit. A minute and a half to drive over there. Like I got there in 20 seconds the first time, I'm pretty sure. I am not excited for when this game gets into the late stages. We got, um... We got the... We got a lot of easy races to go here. Once it gets into the Compton section, that's when it starts to get, you know, a little stupid. But, like, it's, it's really easy all the way up through Compton. But when you go to the port place where there's just so many things to just run into that just explode your car... Like, so much of the environment that we're driving through right now is destructible. Such as that right there. We're gonna go in this direction instead, I've decided. And, um... And yeah, you got all the cars, but you can just drive on the sidewalk and get a, and get away from all the traffic. Well, in um, in the port section, you know, there's like no sidewalks. It's all just like train tracks, and then you got all the stationary garbage in the way on the sides. And you know, if you just if you run into like like you got the trees here and you got the telephone poles, but all those are destructible. Like you can just just go right through them. Well. The ports are not the same. The ports are miserable. Man, am I being fancy right now taking this shortcut? Goodness gracious. Oh, hello, officer. I thought I was being... Oh, my. Hello, more officers. Hello, more officers. Okay, we're almost there. Well, I don't even need to go to my house. I just need to get out of the borough here. Look at that. Wow. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> It took less than a minute. Oh no, it was counting down, I'm sorry. Well, that was fun. $7,000 for destroying a Ferris wheel. What, does some guy just come up to me on the street like, Yo, were you the guy that destroyed the Ferris wheel? Here's $7,000. I don't know why, just take it. Don't ask questions, just take it. Doesn't even make any sense, dude. Why would someone pay me $7,000 after that? This game does not make any sense. It's confusing. Alright, well that was fun. I'm gonna do something silly. We are going to drive, um... A new car today. We're going to drive one of the Impalas, because... I feel... I feel like we need to get a gist of all the fancy dancy vehicles that we get in the game. I've, I've, I've spent so much time driving the starter car and it's like, you know what? You know what? Let's, let's, let's make it a little bit more challenging here, so. Um, wait, I'm going in the wrong direction entirely. Already drove the 64 Impala home. I haven't even touched the 59 Impala yet, so. Let's get that one out and give it a shot. It's gonna be garbage, but you know, it's fine. It's fine. We'll be fine. You just have to go. All right, into the Impala. Yeah. Actually, you know what, all things considered? Pretty solid on the acceleration. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy with this decision. We're gonna, we're gonna drive this for at least one race. And the next race is literally right here. Perfect. It's right around the corner. My goodness. Oh my goodness, it's right around the corner. If I can find a way over there. Can I go this way? Am I allowed to go this way? I might be allowed to go this way. Oh my goodness, they didn't put up an arbitrary wall to prevent me from going in this direction. Amazing. Okay, so it's awful on the brakes. Good thing that we know that now. Street race seven. Three thousand dollars to get into this thing. Anyway, let's continue into this race. What's it gonna be like? I don't know. I didn't play through this game as much as I did the other ones. I just screwed around in this game. Like a lot like MX Unleashed. Just screwed around in MX Unleashed. 
That's what I did in this game. I really didn't play through the plot very much besides like the first instance of it. I've only ever completed this game's story one time. I think that says a little bit more about my commitment than it does the actual game because we've been we've been getting through this pretty solidly so far. I I haven't had to restart a plot race yet. So, oh, that might change. That might be about to change. But it's okay. I only need to finish third in these races. Apparently, it's like that's that's how difficult this game is. It's like you got. I hate to keep bringing up Need for Speed Most Wanted, but like that's. That's like the closest game that you can compare this Driver, to, right I would, to I would side. think anyway. It's just like, they're very similar in setup, kind of. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, you, you start out Need for Speed Most Wanted with the best car in the game in the prologue, and then you lose the best car in the game, and then it's like you're spending the rest of the game trying to get it back. Well, that's what you're doing in this game is that you're, ugh. Oh, Come on, dude. You're spending all of the game trying to get back your amazing car collection. And whoi! Officer, shut up. You're so loud. Thank you. Oh my god, at last. Yeah, it's like... Yeah, that's that's really what it is. But in that game, you have to win every single race. It's like, that's, that's just how it is. Every single race must be won, of course. Of course they're spawning someone in that exact spot. Um, where do I go to get to this next thing? I don't know when to break, I don't know when to turn, I don't know when to do anything. I'm just a stupid idiot playing this game. Oh, that guy found an amazing shortcut, naturally. Naturally, that guy back there finds an amazing shortcut, yeah. Probably looked up the game's official uh, preview and press guide or whatever. Like. I have the Spider-Man official strat- Spider-Man 2 on PS2 official strategy guide. Uh oh. Oh dear. Okay, we got a miracle where I was able to get onto the correct side of the road there, that's good. Not a lot of times does a miracle like that take place. I'm, I'm stunned that they did not spawn any traffic on this road here. Oh, uh, I picked a bad race to drive this car, dude. <laughs> I made a... Made a big ol' oopsie on this day. An oopsie poopsie, if you will. Go go and pick, like, the car with the slowest top speed out of all of them, and then we have a big, long highway section here. See, like that guy, the green guy, is just catching up with me casually. Oh, no. Oh, no. I have to get off here. This is my exit! No! Bitch. Excuse you. I'm just trying to take a normal route through this game, and you had to be an asshole and run into me. He just had to be an asshole. Oh. Oh, he's right next to me, dude. Oh. Oh, it's a drag race to the line. Except it's not, because I don't know where the fucking finish is. Come on, dude. Fuck it. Oh my god, the lag doesn't help. You'd think that the game slowing down would actually help you. No. That's a bus! Oh, it doesn't help you at all! It doesn't give you, oh, any opportunity to make any precise, minute adjustments. Oh, that's the end, that's the end, that's the end, that's the end, that's the end! That's the end right there! Where do I turn? Right here! Right here is where I turn! Boost! Boost to the end! Oh, he crashed! Yes! Uncontested win. Let's go. I didn't have a doubt for a second. I knew I had it. Oh, 21 seconds off. See, that'll, that's that's just the uh, that's the low top speed that did that there. That's the reason. Good lord, that was awful. God help me. Okay, well. Anyway. Okay, we're good. That's fine. That's fine. We're good. Muscle cars have power and speed. Not this one. <laughs> Not this muscle car. Well, there we go. We got it out of the way. We got the 59 Impala out of the way. Now I don't have to drive this again for the rest of the game. Found some more of your property at the same spot where they'll be running for years. Two birds with one stone, see? Okay. If you say so. Maniac. No, you're the maniac. She's a maniac, maniac on the floor. 
that she's dancing like she's never danced before. Oh, I made a poor decision. You can't get out of this little parking lot area. Oh, there's so many stunts everywhere. Oh, they're all just so tempting. I am being tempted to do these miserable stunt things. Oh, cool. It's going off the ramp. Fun. I love when it starts on the... Well, at least when it starts on the ramp, that means that you know which direction you're supposed to go. And it's not just a complete guessing game. Alright, ten seconds. Let's see if I can do it. Oh, big old jump. Alright, great start to this one. Pizza time. Oh, no. It's not pizza time. I just went to Walmart and I did not buy a pizza, so it is not pizza time, in fact. I can't believe how responsible I've been with my eating decisions lately. Because I have been going to Walmart, like, on a regular basis. Like, my fridge is the most full that it's ever been since I started living on my own. Right now. Alright, well, we weren't gonna get it anyway. Yeah, that was awful. This car is awful, though. I don't know what I was expecting. Let's hope that this car that I'm about to get is better than this one. Yeah, because I just spent like $36 there, and I and I should have like two weeks worth of food, which is surprising. Grocery prices have been offensive lately. I bought two spicy chicken sandwiches because I, I, I've been buying just one. Just one bag of spicy chicken sandwiches, you know. And I don't know what I was thinking. I didn't. I don't know why I thought I was going to be able to live off of that. All right, I was actually going to go for that. What are you doing, officer? Officer, please stop. I'm trying to go commit crimes, officer. Oh, it just keeps. It keeps teleporting the fucking. Okay, just just put a goddamn marker on it, I guess. Yeah, it's all the way over here. Yeah. Oh, there's a knockout race, I think, that was right there, too. That's open. I will go do this first, I think. I bought some fruit. I bought a seasonal blend of fruit. There's, like, some cantaloupe in there. I bought it for the pineapple. Watch it. You watch it. Oh, my God. Where is the turn? I don't know where the turn is. Ugh. Okay. Hello. Oh, we're just going in someone's driveway. Hello. Hello, I'm taking your car. Yeet. I bought some Tic Tacs, too. It's probably the least interesting. I, 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 I got some of the Walmart brand breadsticks. And the exact same ones as the Kohl's breadsticks. Except for some reason, they don't have the Kohl's breadsticks at Walmart. So I'm just buying their cheaper version of the product. I don't know. Oh, really? Look at all these Dodge Rams. Why would there be so many people trying to keep me from taking this, this piece of garbage, this absolute pile of shit vehicle. Why would anyone even care if I took this? Oh, there's a wall. This game sucks. Guess we're going this way. Just lost 10% health because of a fucking wall. Yeah, I think this might be the closest um, repossession in your entire in the entire game. It's just like, it's just right, right down the fucking street from my house. And of course, I'm losing all this fucking health because they had to put a fucking wall in the way of everything. That was one of the worst runs that I've ever had. That was awful. Now, I mean, it's only deserved for this piece of shit vehicle. Look at this lag and it's disgusting and hideous. 17 fucking percent. That's somehow number two. What the hell is Tony doing to get 60% damage? It's literally right around the corner from your house. Stupid is what this game is. Anyway. Yeah. Yeah. There's some weird traffic patterns in this game. Something I discovered over my years of um, playing this game casually without actually, you know, doing races is that the traffic patterns in this game are very strange. First, we have a phone call. What once was yours is yours once more. Good work, T. Now, one more race and this town is back to being yours. Show no mercy. Maybe you have to win the final race. That might be the case. Well, I'm not driving this, so you can forget about that. But yeah, 
Taxis never spawn on the highways. The highways are highlighted in yellow in this game. Taxis will never spawn on them. I don't know why, but that's just how it is. Um, what else? I want to drive this again. Um, buses don't spawn out of races. They're all scripted. All the buses are scripted, but the semis aren't. You'll see semis on the normal day-to-day -day thing, just not in the city. You'll see that on, like, the outskirts of town and on the highways and whatever, but they don't spawn in the cities like they do in the races. Um, yeah, there's a train in this game. It's pretty cool. Um, okay, so there's the knockout race, and then there's this. We're going to do this. Up to side. I don't think you're actually able to get West Coast Customs upgrades on the Midway Custom concept cars. You might. I might be lying right now. You might be able to do that, but like... I don't think you can. God, just look at how fast this is, dude. It's, it's ridiculous. This thing is overpowered. It is OP! Okay, I'm sorry. Not really. I'm not sorry, actually. I'm just tired. <laughs> I only slept for like four hours, and then I laid there not sleeping for another hour. Like, are you kidding me? I only sleep for four hours, and I'm still just laying here not sleeping, and it's like, really? Really? That's what I get for having the nerve to go to bed two hours early. Should have known better. Going 40 miles an hour into this corner, and I'm still overdriving the track. Oh! Oh! Oh, he's spinning! What a fucking Chad! What a fucking Chad! Did you see that? This absolute fucking beast! Oh my god, I can't even be mad! That was such a good save! Holy shit! That was so good. And I can't fucking drive forward because this car sucks and this track sucks and this game sucks. <laughs>